Alright, welcome to your first video, just getting to know your robot. This big brick on the top is often called the brick. I also sometimes call it the brain. You're going to have spaces on your brick where you plug in ports for inputs. That would be sensors giving your brain information. And for outputs, and that would be um, for motors. So your brain telling your motors what to do. When you want to turn on your robot, press and hold the center button. Okay, then it's going to say starting, and it takes a good 30 seconds to start. You'll hear that startup noise, and the green lights will show up here by uh, your buttons. Now, let's talk about your buttons for a moment. This is your back button. Anytime you need to go back out of a program, you have up, down, left, and right, and your center button is your select. Okay? Up on the screen, let's see, we have this little play button. This shows recently run programs. You can see all of the little plays next to it. If you want to go down, uh, to a different program, you would go down. If you want to run a program, then you'd push the center button. All right. Now, on your screen, the next one over, you can get there by pushing your right button. Looks like a clipboard. This is going to be where you have all of the programs that you've downloaded. If you look closely, there is a folder next to those. So if you uh, push your center button on a folder, below it you'll see the play button for the program that it will actually run. So you can't run a folder, you can only run the button or the, the play program that has the play button. So recently run programs, your files that you've downloaded, Next one over has six squares. The most important one that we use is the port view, and that will be in a different video. The fourth one over is all of your settings, your volume, when will your robot turn off and go to sleep, if it's uh, Bluetooth or Wi-Fi enabled, and your brick name. Please don't change your brick name unless you have permission to, then your brick info. Anytime I want to get out of there, I just push my back button and it'll take you back to the beginning here. To turn off your robot, we're going to push the back button as many times as required till it tells you power. Then you have X like don't turn off the power, or you have check mark like do turn off the power. When you do want to turn off the power, push your middle button on the check mark and it will shut down. Please remember to shut down your robot every day at the end of class.